What an incredible day we had today. As you can tell behind me, the family's here from Sally Mae Fleming Brown, who decided one day that she wasn't gonna sit in the back of the bus and said she just wasn't gonna do it and didn't. And she opened up the gateway for the court case for Rosa Parks. A lot of times we're bringing the meaning to places that we go, really connecting with the community. In this case, there was already a really profound story of Sarah Mae Fleming, and we're honored that we got to be a, a small part in helping tell that story on a community-wide scale. Uh, we wanted to bring a life, to bring a movement to this story, uh, because we think it's still a story that is very much still living. So there's a famous case called Fleming versus SCENG that it's filed 17 months before the famous incident of Rosa Parks. And so while many in this country know the pioneering work of Rosa Parks, very few know of the precedent case of Sarah Mae Fleming. I was sort of the lead in using a similar process to what One Columbia uses for mo all of its public art projects. And I've learned more about her as a person through this process and I find that uh, really interesting how sort of self-sufficient she was. These four pieces of art tell the amazingly challenging, sometimes painful, but beautiful story of the African seed and the American sun right here in Columbia, South Carolina. It allows an opportunity uh, for our young people uh, to be able to engage in African American history where they live. For some, they may never go to a museum or they may, may never go to an art gallery, but they're gonna come to a local gym. They're gonna come to a local uh, recreation facility. And at that point, we reach them where they are. So we're excited about this opportunity to educate. We're excited about this opportunity to, to be able to share history, African-American history, to those young people that may not get opportunities to be exposed to this type of information. So we're grateful to our mayor. We're grateful to our city council. We're grateful to our city manager for endorsing and supporting uh, this process.